I am Jane. And I'm Jen. And it's time for One Star Reviews. Yeah, can you guess what these highly rated, very popular games are based on their One Star Reviews? Why don't you kick us off? Well, here's the first review. Glad to be one of 183 voters rating this game a 1. Would rate a 0 if I could. Euro. Digging through a deck in hopes of finding parts to your engine is a horrible experience. When that experience lasts for four hours at a time, the game is not worth the hype. Too heavy. No game in here just distracts you for four hours and is pretty expensive. Most overrated game of all time on BGG. Such a boring game with ugly, low quality components, poor artwork, and bland board. There are just so many far superior games that I cannot understand why anyone would play this game ever. Really? Hmm, turning cubes into other cubes for four hours? <laughs> Honestly, it's a trash tier game masquerading behind a cool theme, all luck dependent, based on card drawing. This game is too hyped. The theme is awesome, but the gameplay is rubbish. You just pile up stock, but you don't have enough actions to spend whatever you have stocked. So what do you get the next round? Yes, more stuff you don't need to use. This game doesn't make sense. If you think you like this game, don't just get Settlers of Catan. <laughs> It basically does the same, but at least lets you trade goods with a player bank. Overhyped. The art is so bad and inconsistent, it defies description. Gameplay is just incredibly dry and tedious. Plus, pretty tired of Mars-themed games by this point. What is this? The new zombie Cthulhu slapstick theme all over again? It is. Anyway, <laughs> so uh, guess the game below in the comments. And we'll reveal in a couple of days. It's time, time for the reveal of this week's One Star Review. Some of you guessed it. We dropped a pretty big hint there at the end. It's a game about Mars. It's four hours long and there's a lot of cards in it. You guessed it. It's Terraforming Mars. This is a game we absolutely love and we never want it to be shorter. We love the long, long version of it, but I can see how some people might get a little bit tired of that very long, very uh, heavy card-driven game. Did you get it? Tune in next week for our next one-star review.